that is coming in now, former Chief Minister of Bihar, popularly known as Jan Nayak, Karpuri Thakur, has been awarded the Bharat Ratna posthumously. Thakur, remember, was in office twice. Once for a brief period of six months between 1970 and 71, and then from 77 to 79. The decision is politically significant as Karpuri Thakur was a tall socialist leader who was born in Nai Samaj or the Baba community, which is one of the most backward castes of Bihar. The award will be conferred tomorrow, which is the 24th of January, his birth anniversary. So the question is, what does it mean for OBC politics now onwards and what does it mean for Bihar politics? Let me bring uh, Sushil Modi, BJP MP first on the show. Mr. Modi, one may say that this is caste politics, the BJP way. No, say it is not caste politics. Though it is true that Karpuri Thakur fought for the rights of the EBC, extremely backward classes. Before that, there were obviously they were dominating the political scene of Bihar and other states, and the extremely backward classes. They were being ignored. And Karpuri Thakur for the first time in the year 1978, he implemented Mungeri Kalal Commission report in which reservation was bifurcated between OBC and EBC. And 12% reservation was given to EBC community. And I want to give the Prime who is fulfilling the uh, ideals of Karpuri Thakur. Karpuri Thakur ke sapno ko एक दूसरा अति पिछड़ा समाज से आने वाला नरेंद्र मोदी आज उनके सपने को पूरा कर रहा है लालू यादव 10 साल तक केंद्र में मंत्री थे 5 साल रेल मंत्री थे वाई लालू यादव नेवर कॉन्फर्ड भारत रत्न टू करपुरी ठाकुर वाई नीतीश कुमार ही वाज आल्सो सेंट्रल मिनिस्टर फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम एट द सेंटर बट एवरी डे एवरी टाइम ऑन 24 जनवरी दे यूज्ड टू शो देयर लिप सर्विस बाय डिमांडिंग कि भारत रत्न मिलना चाहिए तो जो काम कोई नहीं कर पाया वो काम आज नरेंद्र मोदी ने करके दिखला दिया और एक गरीब का बेटा करपुरी ठाकुर के जब डेथ हुई ही हैड नो प्रॉपर्टी इन हिज नेम और फ्यू हंड्रेड रुपीस इन हिज बैंक इन हिज बैंक अकाउंट एंड करपुरी ठाकुर फॉर्ड हिज एंटायर लाइफ फॉर द पुअर फॉर द डाउन ट्रोडन पीपल ऑफ दिस कंट्री एंड द सेम थिंग इज बीइंग डन बाय नरेंद्र मोदी ही इज आल्सो प्रोवाइडिंग Uh, uh, toilets to the poor people, uh, can have electric connections, jal ka nal. So, gariboon ke liye jo sapna dekha ta Karpuri Thakur ji ko. Aur jin ko bhoot kam sama mila karne ke liye. Modi ji. Wo kaam aaj Narendra Modi ne karke dikhla diya. Sushil Modi ji, ye bhi kaha ja sakta hai, cast card hai, bhajpa khel rahi hai in the name of awards. Kyunki ye aapka jawaab hai cast census par jo Nitish Kumar ne announce kiya tha. और जो उनका कास्ट का जो सर्वे आया है नहीं देखिए ये किसी का रिप्लाई नहीं है ये सम्मान है करपुरी ठाकुर का और उनका जो कंट्रीब्यूशन रहा है हर साल पिछले 20 वर्षों से हर एक दल के लोग बिहार में मांग करते रहे कि करपुरी जी को भारत रत्न मिलना चाहिए सो इट इज नथिंग टू डू विद कास्ट पॉलिटिक्स इट इज नथिंग टू डू टू काउंटर द कास्ट सर्वे दैट हैपन इन बिहार Though in the caste survey it was shown that there are 36% of EBC in Bihar. So, the EBC is the most important part of the EBC, the most important part of the EBC, which was the most important part of the EBC, which was the most important part of the EBC. So, I said that if there was no one who was doing the EBC, then they were doing the EBC. And today, they were doing the most important part of the EBC, and they were doing the most important part of the EBC, and they were doing the most important part of the EBC, गरीबों को लड़ने वालों को सम्मानित किया है और आप देखेंगे पिछले सात आठ साल में नरेंद्र मोदी जी ने जिनको भी भारत रत्न दिया या पद्मश्री दिया या अन्य पुरस्कार दिए वो सारे उन लोगों को दिए जिन लोगों ने गरीबों के लिए काम किया करपुरी जी को कांग्रेस के जमाने में तो कभी भारत रत्न नहीं मिल सकता था राहुल गांधी भले कास्ट सेंसस की बात करते रहे लेकिन कभी कांग्रेस के लोग तो हमेशा करपुरी ठाकुर को कुचलने का काम करते रहे और करपुरी ठाकुर ही फोर्ट अगेंस्ट द टेरिनी ऑफ 
Congress regime in India he was imprisoned during emergency also. और उन्होंने भारतीय भाषाओं के विकास के लिए काम किया कर्पूरी जी ने जब वो शिक्षा मंत्री थे तो उन्होंने इंग्लिश के कंपल्सरी को खत्म कर दिया कि मैट्रिक जो लड़का पास करेगा अगर इंग्लिश में फेल भी कर जाए तो भी उसको सर्टिफिकेट मिलेगा मैट्रिक पास का और उसको लोग मजाक करते थे कर्पूरी डिवीजन और कर्पूरी ठाकुर को कितनी गालियां खानी पड़ी जब उन्होंने आरक्षण लागू किया एक बात मैं और बता दू कर्पूरी जी ने जब 26 परसेंट आरक्षण दिया उस सरकार में पंडित कैलाश पति मिश्रा शामिल थे जो भारतीय जनसंघ कोटे से नंबर दो के मंत्री थे फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर थे बिहार के तो इसलिए इस देश के अंदर पिछड़ों को थे पिछड़ों को तरतव सम्मान मिला है जब उस सरकार में भारतीय जनता पार्टी सुशील मोदी जी देर हो गई क्या नौ साल से आपकी सरकार है दसवा इनफैक्ट साल चल रहा है केंद्र में देर हो गई क्या क्योंकि बिहार में आप पावर में अभी जरूरी नहीं अभी नहीं है तो शायद इसलिए आपको लग रहा है कि ये बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट कार्ड है और शायद ये चेकमेट कर सकता है नीतीश और लालू जी को नहीं देखिए मुझे लगता है कि इसकी तुलना कास्ट कार्ड से करके अब भारत रत्न की उपाधि को और डिमिनिश कर रही उसके महत्व को कम कर रही है क्या पिछले बार अगर पद्म विभूषण की उपाधि मिली मुलायम सिंह यादव को तो कोई कहे कि आप पुराना वोट बैंक के लिए कर रहे हैं अब तो हर जाते हर व्यक्ति की कोई ना कोई जाति है आप सीधे उसको जाति से जोड़ देंगे तो मैंने कहा दिस इज नथिंग टू डू विद कास्ट सेंसस कास्ट सर्वे और टू चेकमेट नीतीश कुमार अरे नीतीश कुमार का तो जो ईबीसी वोट बैंक है दैट इज ऑलरेडी शिफ्टेड टूवर्ड्स बीजेपी अब है उनके पास क्या बचा है नीतीश कुमार के पास तो कुछ बचा नहीं लवकुश उनका बीजेपी की तरफ आ गया ईबीसी उनका बीजेपी की तरफ आ गया तो इसलिए देखिए कर्पूरी जी को जो सम्मान दिया है उसकी तुलना कोई और कास्ट सेंसस को काउंटर चेक करने के लिए चेकमेट करने के लिए किया गया है ये कहना शायद उचित नहीं होगा बिहार की पॉलिटिक्स को कैसे बदलते हुए देख रहे हैं सुशील मोदी जी आखिरी सवाल है ये मेरा आपसे नहीं देखिये बिहार की पॉलिटिक्स बदल चुकी है और जो ईबीसी 36 परसेंट है जिसके मालिक एक समय में नीतीश कुमार हुआ करते थे वो 2014 में नरेंद्र मोदी को बिहार की ईबीसी ने एक एक वोट दिया क्योंकि तो वो मानता है कि नरेंद्र मोदी ईबीसी है और इस चुनाव के अंदर भी नीतीश कुमार लालू से किसी से समझौता कर ले जो अति पिछड़ा 36 परसेंट है वो एक एक वोट इस बार भी दो में नरेंद्र मोदी को मिलेगा तो क्या ये माना जाए कि ये ये मूव से पॉलिटिकल uh, मैसेजिंग भी गई है नीतीश कुमार को कि इधर के लिए भी दरवाजा खुल गया है मैंने देखिए दरवाजा खुलने बा, दरवाजा खुलने बंद होने का सवाल ही नहीं है वो एक अलग विषय मैं नहीं समझता हूँ कि आज के इस ऐतिहासिक मौके पर जी और इसकी तुलना नीतीश कुमार के लिए दरवाजा बंद रहेगा कि खुला रहेगा क्योंकि तो अब हमको नीतीश कुमार की जरूरत ही नहीं है जब उनका वोट हमारे साथ आ गया तो वो आए ना से क्या फर्क पड़ने वाला है देखिए बिहार में तीन बार इलेक्शन हुआ दो में हम चुनाव जीत गए और एक में हमको बासठ हजार वोट आया इसलिए वो पुराने जमाने की बात थी जब लव कुश था नीतीश कुमार के साथ ईबीसी था नीतीश कुमार के साथ अति पिछड़ों के नेता थे जब से उन्होंने तेजस्वी यादव को अपना उत्तराधिकारी घोषित कर दिया कोई ईबीसी कम्युनिटी का व्यक्ति तेजस्वी को अपना नेता स्वीकार करने के लिए तैयार नहीं है भले ही नीतीश कुमार ने किसी मजबूरी में तेजस्वी को अपना उत्तराधिकारी घोषित कर दिया चलिए सुशील मोदी जी रियली अप्रिशिएट योर टाइम थैंक यू फॉर स्पीकिंग टू एनडी टीवी ऑन व्हाट क्लियरली इज अ बिग मूव बाय द बीजेपी व्हाट नेक्स्ट एज वी हैव बीन आस्किंग ऑन दिस शो फॉर बिहार पॉलिटिक्स अभिषेक यू नो वन मे से दैट दिस वाज लॉन्ग ड्यू लॉन्ग ओवर ड्यू दैट द जन नायक पॉपुलरली नोन एज जन नायक पीपल्स लीडर शुड हैव बीन गिवन दैट प्लेस ऑफ प्राइड द प्लेस और द अवार्ड व्हिच वाज मच मच नीडेड Nitish Kumar was part of the NDA. Why didn't he make that effort to ensure that Bihar's former chief minister gets that award? Why see, did he fail clear. in his efforts? See. Or did he not make an effort in, you know enough? Nitish Kumar ji's effort is in public and uh, I know that you are a very senior journalist you must be aware of all the facts. and all the happenings in the past also when we were part of nda then also nitish kumar ji has have has put his demand very firmly 
दैट जननायक कर्पूरी ठाकुर जी शुड बी शुड बी अवार्डेड विद दिस भारत रथ तो हुआ क्यों नहीं मेनी अटेम्प्ट्स वी हैव पुट दिस इन फ्रंट ऑफ द सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट whether congress was there or bjp was there in but the why center. didn't you actually ensure that it is, it happens because nitish was an important ally of the bjp we in politics or in social life we have the ability to put forward our demand that to in front of the government we were certainly part of the government not to actually we had participated ever in the government in this india alliance but nitish kumar has always firmly put up this demand and today we strongly congratulate him that this is the kind of victory of everyone who is acquainted with karpuri thakur ji's vichardhara and the thing which is most important for today is that everyone who has worked with karpuri thakur ji who has uh, known about his behaviors and uh, his way of working that too for with the what, deprived what was said by like sushil that. modi here one, 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 where one, he one, said one moment abhishek very said that the ebc vote will move away from you completely sushil kumar modi ji has made a very contradictory statement on one hand pradhan mantri ji always speaks that there are two castes in the nation one is rich and the other is poor on the other hand sushil kumar modi ji just now said that no, the no, ebc no the prime vote, minister has never said that there are two castes the rich is another caste no 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 that's factually incorrect he might or not the spokesperson of the bjp no 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 but that is factually incorrect i am a political observer also let me speak let me speak i am also a political observer you can't make factually incorrect statements ramit bhai kya hai let me speak maria let me speak on the other hand sushil kumar modi ji just now mentioned that the ebc vote bank has shifted towards bjp just because honorable prime minister modi ji is ebc what does this mean if a person who is on the top post post belongs to a specific caste that means bjp believes strongly in this that the vote bank will be shifted like that other thing is justice delayed is always justice denied we have always put forward this demand and in the 10th year bjp uh, has taken a decision the central government has taken a decision we are happy with it akilesh is well you cannot akilesh, forget that justice would you delayed say, justice denied would you say that you know this is an epoch making mo- moment in certainly politics of bihar it's one of those moments which can change the dynamics completely from now onwards Being for the janmaya has- to be awarded this highest citizen award of bharat ratna the biggest award is What is a strong general? indication no absolutely See, maria i believe that this Akhilesh, is a very big move street. by the yes. bjp Uh, especially keeping in mind the upcoming lok sabha elections where the bjp does not have nitish kumar this time because the bihar's equation is very clear there are three major players rjd jdu and bjp whenever these two parties among three are together they are in advantageous position bjp this time does not have major political parties along with it that is why party has decided to you know now reply nitish kumar's politics in his, in his own language there the, there's the language of uh, ebc extremely backward caste and we have seen that how nitish kumar has tried to you know make it a big issue of uh, caste uh, census and caste survey and after that rahul gandhi picked this up and promised that in every assembly election that whenever if congress party comes they will go for the caste census so now bjp replying that Uh, issue in bihar itself where karpuri thakur who is the first uh, leader of bihar who implemented the obc reservation and long before vp singh implemented the mandal commission report so he is the real masiha uh, of the obcs in bihar and is a solver leader and now bjp honoring him with this bharat ratna of course uh, uh, gives party an adv- advantage as far as bihar politics is concerned because bjp is clearly eyeing the ebc vote bank of nitish kumar Yes so thank you so much for that update uh, Akhilesh someone who tracks the BJP and the government very very closely for us we'll try and go back to Abhishek Jha in just a bit but good but uh, Guru Prakash Paswan uh, you know Mr Sushil Modi really did not uh, reply to my question but I'm going to ask that to you Guru of course this is uh, a significant step but this is a caste card you are doing caste in the name of awards you're playing that and trying to look for a counter to nitish kumar's caste census maria i think uh, you have put it very wonderfully when you said that this is an epochal moment and uh, right after uh, the pran pratishtha this has come for the people of bihar it's very important and it's also very important for us to realize that karpuri thakur till date 
remains the only leader who has been given the title of Jananayak, people's hero. So that is something which is very crucial. I still very well categorically remember, Maria, when Karpuri Thakurji became the chief minister for the first time, the sort of slogan that was raised by feudal elements in Bihar, because he came from Nai community, because he came from Barber community, who used the razor, who used the astura, the slogan that was raised in the society of Bihar was Karpuri, Karpura, Chhod Kursi, Pakad Astura. This is a soul-stirring statement. This is a soul-stirring slogan that a man who comes from Nai community, that a man who comes from Barber community cannot sit on the chair, but he has to hold the Astura. So that man has seen a lot. Karpuri, Thakur, Maria, you must realize for the people of Bihar, for the marginalized, for the disadvantaged, he is the second Baba Sahib Ambedkar. You would very well know. Karpuri Thakur restricting his legacy in the name of caste is the biggest disservice to his soul. Karpuri Thakur was the first political person, Maria, who envisioned reservation or preferential treatment for women. Who envisioned reservation for economically weaker section among the upper caste as well. And that reservation happened in the government where Bharatiya Lokdal and Jansang were together. So you have to understand, whatever Sushilji said made a lot of sense. Prime Minister himself comes from the EBC community. He understands the pain, the sensibilities of the EBC community. So Bharat Ratna to Karpuri Thakur, this is indeed as observed by you, is an epochal moment. Jananayak Karpuri Thakur, Karpuri Thakur, who tolerated jibes but, like Karpuri, Karpura, Chhod Kursi, Pakkar Astura. Yes. This is something which is... Yes, it is written in the history impactful. books. I remember very clearly, Guru. But my question is also that is this some kind of opportunity being given to Nitish Kumar to perhaps make a ghar vapsi? Because he can make this a talking point that he tried really hard in multiple governments, that he should be given a, a, a Bharat Ratna, and that now that it has been given by the BJP government at the center, by Mr. Modi at the center, he may just look at BJP, you know, perhaps very differently now. Equations can change. Is that a possibility? No, no, Maria, I think uh, Mr. Nitish Kumar's political credibility or political trustworthiness is something on which we would not like to comment. It's out in the public domain. But uh, we must understand that... Uh, Jananayak Karpuri Thakur, because of his integrity, because of his probity in public life, has been acknowledged for this uh, award. Whether or not Nitish Kumar is influenced by this decision or not, is not something which is our call. And this decision has been taken, not uh, keeping Nitish Kumarji in mind. Nitish Kumarji is a different thing. Jananayak Karpuri Thakur, Maria, now again, I am very much persuaded to give you a quote from senior journalist Surendra Kishorji, when Jannai Karpuri Thakurji met uh, Chandrasekhar, the Prime Minister, Chandrasekhar collected Chanda so that Karpuri Thakur can get a new kurta. So, Karpuri Thakur is an emotion, Maria. Karpuri Thakur is not a politician for people like us. Karpuri Thakur is a bhao. Hai. Karpuri Thakur is a bhao. Karpuri Thakur is a bhao. Karpuri Thakur is a bhao. Karpuri ji matro vekti nahi hai. To Karpuri ji ko Bharat Ratan milne se whether Nitish will be persuaded or not. This is something which is very secondary. This is like trivializing. Repeatedly, repeatedly Guru, uh, be it Mr. Nitish Kumar or Lalu Yadav had quoted Karpuri Thakur in the context of Bihar. That every time there would be a political move, Karpuri Thakur and his legacy would be quoted because uh, he was the tallest OBC leader. But yes, um, I would agree with you that he was a stalwart of uh, social justice, that uh, he was seen as an inspiring figure of not just Bihar, but also of Indian politics. But you may also agree with me that at a time when the BJP is looking at trying to build its own caste combination in the state of Bihar, uh, a Bharat Ratna to Karpuri Thakur would mean that the EBCs can look at BJP very differently from what they did, say, a day back. Maria, as you said, and uh, Prime Minister, especially the Bharti Janta Party under the leadership of Honorable Prime Minister, our policy decisions or any decision is not influenced by votes, is not influenced by election. And I say this with a lot of respect. I say this with a lot of autonomy at my this thing. It, this is done keeping in mind 
द स्टॉलवर्ड द पर्सनैलिटी दैट करपुरी ठाकुर कमांडेड दैट करपुरी ठाकुर इंस्पायर्ड मरिया यशवंत सिन्हा फॉर्मर फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर यूज टू बी द प्राइवेट सेक्रेटरी टू करपुरी ठाकुर जी एंड वंस ही वेंट टू पितौंजिया विच इज नाउ नोन एज करपुरी ग्राम इन द डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ समस्तीपुर वो बताते हैं इन हिज ऑटोबायोग्राफी रिलेंटलेस दैट हाउ करपुरी ठाकुर वाइफ शी वॉज जस्ट नॉट एबल टू मैनेज अ कप ऑफ टी फॉर यशवंत सिन्हा सो फॉर अज मरे आई एम टाइम एन अगेन सेइंग दैट दिस डिसीजन टू गिव भारत रत्न टू करपुरी ठाकुर वाज लॉन्ग पेंडिंग ओनली अ प्राइम मिनिस्टर विद द विजन विद द मैग्नानिमिटी एंड द इमेजिनेशन ऑफ इंक्लूसिविटी कुड हैव डन दिस नो वन अदर इन द हिस्ट्री ऑफ आवर पॉलिटिक्स हैज इवन एक्नॉलेज्ड आज बिहार में करपुरी जी का क्या होता है so the so called followers of karpuri thakur maria nitish ji and lalu ji have yes, restricted i am actually history. waiting to hear what their first reaction would be guru thank you so much for joining us the prime minister though has tweeted and i would ask the uh, producer to put his tweet on our television screens he has gone on to say that i am delighted that the government of bihar india government of india has decided to confer the bharat ratna on the beacon of social justice the great jannaya karpuri thakur then he goes on to say his unwavering commitment to uplift the downtrodden and his visionary leadership have left an indelible mark on india's social political fabric what next for politics of bihar that remains to be seen because nitish kumar and lalu yadav haven't really said anything till now